Hi, I'm meteorologist Tony Petraka in the Pinpoint 12 Forecast Center. You clicked on the Weather Now link on this Thursday afternoon about almost four o'clock. Precipitation is gone. A little brightening now taking place in Providence as the clouds start to break apart. Drier air settling in. High temps today, mid 40s, melting more of that snow. Temps now still generally low to mid 40s, including 45 in Providence. We're looking good this evening and right on through the overnight. Uh, the weather looks dry, so threat tracker is low. Even Friday, the daylight hours, no problem for both the morning and the evening commute, but we're still highlighting kind of a messy mix of uh, wet snow, sleet, and rain. So it's not just snow. In fact, we do anticipate a change to sleet and rain. Now, this is for Friday evening, Friday night. Saturday morning around 9 o'clock or just after 9 o'clock. So some slippery travel beyond 9 p.m. tomorrow night, Friday night. And we'll get to more of that in just a second. So dry skies tonight. And looking at that messy weather for Friday night. Very windy on Saturday, especially along the coastline. We could be seeing some gusts up to 50 miles per hour. There'll be some lingering light rain and snow showers on um, Saturday morning. Satellite photo shows. Uh, let's see a little bit of clearing to our north and west. Here's the wider view. That light rain from this morning has moved out, but we draw our attention across the deep south. Unfortunately, an outbreak of severe weather is anticipated tonight across Texas and out towards Louisiana and Arkansas. Uh, that system, minus any severe weather, that moisture headed our way uh, for Friday evening, Friday night into at least um, on Saturday morning. So we take, let's put this into the future and watch. Uh, tonight looks fine. Here we are, uh, Friday morning. Looks good for the uh, commute. Jump ahead to Friday afternoon. Clouds increasing, but still dry. Then you see that precipitation along the mid-Atlantic and near New York City by 6 o'clock in the evening. That overspreads the area by 9 o'clock. Blue is wet snow. Uh, the pink is a mix. The green and reds and yellows indicate some rain. So that transition over to sleet and rain. And because of that, it limits really the snowfall accumulations, which at this point looks small and, and mainly for northern Rhode Island only. This is now overnight, Friday night, pre-dawn Saturday. Very windy Saturday morning. We may switch back to some light, wet snow. I don't anticipate any additional accumulations during the daylight hours of Saturday morning. Uh, but um, still some uh, windy conditions and mixed precipitation. It does clear out. Uh, Saturday evening, Saturday night. All right, here's the uh, the call as far as, well, get a more detailed look once again at uh, this evening and overnight, generally quiet. Here we are Saturday morning, uh, Saturday morning, Friday morning. Start with sunshine, clouds taking over in the afternoon, but still dry. Um, six, seven, eight, uh, eight o'clock in the evening, still dry, and then here comes the precipitation, wet snow, and then we see that transition over to sleet and rain. So here's the uh, how it should play out Friday night. Let's take this apart, kind of like a layer cake. This area in green, a brief mix of sleet going over to rain. This pink area, wet snow and sleet changing to rain. Before that happens, minor accumulations. We're thinking maybe a coating to an inch in this pink zone. Snow and sleet eventually to rain in our northern suburbs and right up in here several inches possible. What do we mean by several inches? Northern part of the state may pick up one to three inches of snow Friday evening, Friday night, right up in here, especially northwest part of the state southern Worcester County before it changes to uh, sleet and eventually some rain. So for this evening, uh, well, ignore that. That is the wrong graphic. <laughs> well, this evening it looks cool and dry, and here we are Friday morning. Um, sunshine to start the day, temperatures in the 30s, and then clouding up um, later Friday afternoon, but staying dry right through the evening commute, and then we'll bring in some of that uh, mixed precipitation uh, Friday evening and into Friday night.